Hello, hello again, welcome back. Let's experience postal brain damage today. It's an FPS from the trailer. My first impression is like a Doom with Quake with I don't know a lot of elements in it. Uh, it looks chaotic, it looks fun, it looks I don't know, maybe challenging. Uh, that's it. Um, postal brain damage can be found on Steam. And the developer is Hyper Strange. Well, let's uh, see what this is all about. Um, yeah. You are about to enter another dimension. A dimension of sound. <laughs> a dimension of sight. Venus. A dimension of mind. You are moving into a land. <clears throat> the fuck? Get out of here, you Rod Sterling wannabe. This is my what? dream. So. <clears throat> listen up. As I said, this is my dream. Like, you will encounter things so fucked up that the current global situation will sound perfectly sane in comparison. Once you see this shit, there's no coming back. And it all started with a TV. Yeah, I'm a simple man. I hear about that one kooky punch-drunk German director guy's best video games movie marathon, and I want to see it. Like, you know, in the name of the kink instant classic, House of Death? Fuck yeah. Fart cries? Boom! Headshot. But, uh, fuck, there's something really, really wrong here. I wake up in a suburb of all places, like it's some shitty nightmare. A neighborhood full of trigger-happy retired policemen, saggy middle-aged soccer moms, and really angry, leg-biting, ass-munching pet pooches. Oh, and my TV isn't working. And that, my dear friend, is only the beginning. So, this is my story. Straight out of suburbia. Beautiful day, no, no, it's not. There's nothing beautiful about fucking suburbia. It's a goddamn nightmare in pastel and beige and SUV. Oh, wait, SUV is the color, is it? Botox queens, cardigan yuppies, trigger happy retired officers, and 1.5 gold retrievers per household. And I wake up and now and get my TV. Time to play a suburban commando. <laughs> Okay. Nice. So I got 14 armor. The health is on the right side. Uh, I only have my hands. So... I punch them? Need a blue key. Okay. Okay, pizza. Yes, it gives health. These I can't take. Alright. Okay, so you get to pass above 100 HP. It's very fast to read jet kick. You oh. load 16 tons. Okay. What do you get? Pick up the shovel. Up to see the shovel. Enemies, we don't have weapons. This is tab with enemies, weapons, locations, and tutorials. Okay. Okay. Check this. My TV that's broken. This is my bed. Upstairs, blue key. This is red key, so I gotta get out. I mean, not out, but. Pistol okay, bullets. We got okay. the blue key. Alrighty. Okay, that's very goodish. 
pick up one health. Okay, hey, blue key is right here. You can insta effect with Q at any time. Control while moving to slide, okay. Chaos. Oh shit. Uh heck is this? Oh, alright, alright. Chaos, oh my goodness. Yeah, you can also slide, so I guess I can't really break this. That's the only exit. No. Oh, I see. Oh, that's... jump you can make longer jumps if you jumps and immediately after start to slide okay okay that's how we get those oh we got the yellow key see if i can make it there not really not like that i'm gonna try again no don't stop the music i enjoyed it Hmm. Why did the music stop? Hmm, I want more music. Oh, there we go. Okay. Let's go to the yellow. Oh shit, you scared the fuck out of me. Yo! Okay. Holy shit. Is that the yellow door? That's the yellow door, isn't it? Hot sauce. This one will make you piss hellfire. Okay. Oh, I get to more than once. Okay. Oh, I see. Yeah. Okay. That wasn't really helpful. I basically burned that dog and he didn't die. So. That's not really useful, is it? Oh, 
Hold R. Oh, oh. excellent. I'm, okay, I, okay. I'm not surprised. You're a fucking smart girl. I am not surprised, but congratulations. Floating Anu Ring. When Shotgun Nick, you can grab floating rings. Oh, okay. That's nice. Congratulations, really. You deserve all the best. I'm really happy for you. Uh, she's doing good. She's doing good. Uh, life is okay, peaceful for now. Just want to see where this goes. I guess I gotta find the TV, which is dead. Okay. So I guess that's the goal of every level. We'll see, we'll see. Alright. Okay, so the goal of every level is to find the TV. There's posters. You're almost halfway. Wow, okay. That was the first level. Let's go next level. Airback Redemption. The name now that's a fine tube. Anything on this side? Oh shit. Okay. I don't like that. Hey, oh, I used it. Okay. if they gave me nothing okay that was the bareback redemption Crazy. Upper I did better class. than the other one, though. Result in seven. I I still don't know how to feel about this game. To be honest, the more progress you make, the uh, weirder it gets. I guess I don't know. Uh, Superland is free to claim. Okay. Next level. D day. You exit a shit pipe and you end up in Mexico, of all places. But there's no time to enjoy the local cockfighting when I'm so close to getting my TV. I just have to return home to the land of the brave. There's only one problem, and it's a wall. A big yeah, goddamn wall on the border. Thing. I wonder who did this. Oh, 
so much yes I was here oh <laughs> it's a book from an enemy I killed holy Okay, I fell. Oh, awesome. Jesus, that's stupid. I basically fell because I didn't sit in one place. Awesome. Let's game. And that's another level done. a little more come on man hmm. that's very chaotic i don't know it was i mean it's not it's a fun game it's just not something i'm used to i was expecting a bit less i don't know it did say it's gorish. It did say it's fast paced, which it is. Um, I well, we are in a dream world, which is is okay because it's all kinds of fucked up. I'm gonna do one more level, and I think I'm gonna. Well, another brick in the wall, I suppose. It's so good, I can almost think of drinking it. Oh, let's go. Leap of faith. Okay. That's it. This is it. Oh, that was very bloody. And leap of Leap of hay. Run him up. Okay. Be the bestest. Exit the menu. Yes. Basically the way, so Codex has enemies, weapons, locations, and tutorials. The way to unlock these is to interact with those posters. The weapons as well, you interact with the po oh, okay, locations as well, and tutorials, I guess, you get as cool. Okay, that's gonna be it for this game. It's chaotic, it's full of action, it's very gorish, which I was not necessarily expecting. I like that it has a bit of a puzzle in it, but not something very difficult. Like, it's pretty intuitive, at least in the first levels. Um, too much 
too many dicks and fuck yous and stuff like that, dildos and whatnot. I guess it's supposed to be funny. Maybe for me it's not. But yeah, the game is on Steam if you want to play it. And it was fun. The music is fun. The only thing that I really dislike about the music is that it stops at very, very random moments. But yeah, thanks for uh, experiencing this with me.